Hello and welcome back to the Bristol Vegan. That's not the sort of energy I'm bringing into this. Hello and welcome back to the Bristol Vegan. The show where I review vegan food in Bristol. It's fairly self-explanatory. We've got two cameras this time and I've got a cameraman, he's moving around. That's a good time. And today we're going to be looking at Honest Burgers. A delicious vegan burger place. Well, it's not actually vegan, it's a regular burger place, but they have a new vegan veganuary special at the moment. And I wanted to try it. And so once we were done shooting um, TLDW today, uh, I got myself some burgers and I got down some too. So yeah, let's have a, have a look, have a look inside. Um, now, let me just get the ingredients up because I'm professional and this is how I do it every time. I look at the ingredients on my phone. So in it, this is the teriyaki plant. So in it we have, it's a plant-based it's a plant -based burger. Pulled shiitake mushrooms, teriyaki sauce, apple with vegan cheese, my favorite kind of vegan cheese. Zoe introduced it to me, it's, it's delicious. Um, grilled peppers, spring onions, umami mayo, and lettuce with a homemade rosemary chips. And that's these here. Not much rosemary on them, but they taste fucking divine. So, chips, give them, what, a seven out of 10? Liquid chips, but they are just chips. Let's get right into the meat of it, the burger. This is, I'm gonna get messy. Have a look at that bad boy. Look at that. Gummy. The bun's very soft. It's nice to have a soft bun. Good fun. Let's get it in First of all, the plant-based burger itself tastes like a natural burger, which is delicious. And the way that the, um, the spring onion and the mushrooms sort of combine in your mouth with a bit of a crunch and a bit of a squish, oh, the flavour is, is delectable to say the least. I'd honestly give this, oh and the cheese is melted beautifully, you don't get that often with vegan cheese, but applewood is excellent for melting. As burgers go, I'd say this is one of the best ones I've ever had. And that's, that's high praise because, well it's not actually because the last time I had a burger, it was from Wetherspoons and that is atrocious. So yeah, I'm going to give this a solid 8 out of 10. Absolutely delicious. Not perfect, but it is glorious. I refuse to hand out 10 out of 10 until it's literally perfect. So, I'll put this down there. I'm not going to eat the whole thing on camera, that would be absurd. That's my caramel getting kind of I think you should enjoy this chip. So that was a very brief episode of the Bristol Vegan. Admittedly, next time I should probably order more things so I can try them all out. And next time we will be going to a fully vegan restaurant called V Burger, um, recommended to me by Bryony of the Yogcast, who once again is refusing to let me edit her podcast. One day, one day I'll, I'll be able to. But yeah, thank you all for watching, and I'll uh, see you on Wednesday with some TLDW. Goodbye for now. Let's join me for some food.